2023 Infiniti QX60 review, strong on value, short on finesse. Buyers shopping for a mid-size luxury SUV have a variety of enticing products from which to choose. For any contender in this segment to stand out, it has to offer something extraordinary. And, while there is little doubt that the 2023 QX60 is Infiniti's best SUV yet, it's also difficult to deny that its mundane origins aren't hidden as well as they perhaps should have been. Derived from the latest R53 generation Nissan Pathfinder, the new Infiniti QX60 SUV makes a valiant effort to distinguish itself from its mass-market origins. Unfortunately, some hints of its ancestry remain in its non-premium engine and wallowing dynamic abilities. Only one power unit is provided, 295 horsepower 3.5 liter naturally aspirated V6 and it can be had with either FWD or AWD. While the venerable VQ35DD engine delivers the ponies, its near three decade old design shows in its comparatively unrefined manners. The driving dynamics show that comfort and smoothness were prioritized at the expense of agility, in contrast to other opponents who managed to be both. And be wary of the available 20-inch wheels, because they upset the ride composure, as we found in our Infiniti QX60 review. That's not to say that the engineers didn't try to make the QX60 more premium, though, the old CVT is finally banished and replaced with a ZF9 speed automatic, and there is copious sound insulation in the attractive cabin. It is loaded with tech and comfort features, so it matches its opponents in the gadget stakes. But in a segment where competitors to the Infiniti QX60 include such luminaries as the Audi Q7 and Volvo XC90, one has to wonder whether this dressed-up Pathfinder offers enough comfort, features, and most importantly, image, to offset its humble underpinnings. 2023 Infiniti QX60 Changes, What's the Difference vs the 2022 QX60? Seeing as the second-generation Infiniti QX60 has only been around for a year, it goes into 2023 without any major changes. The only new items for the 2023 Infiniti QX60 are the addition of a frameless interior rear-view mirror and wireless charging becoming standard across all model grades. If you look closely, you'll also notice revised lower bumper trim colors, becoming gloss black for the Lux and dark gray for sensory and autograph. Furthermore, the Infiniti Premium Care Maintenance Plan is standard from 2023 onwards, covering all maintenance for the first three years of the car's life. Pros and Cons Quiet Cabin Spacious Cabin and Trunk Many standard features at the price Well-made, high-quality interior Lots of safety features Mediocre Driving Dynamics Ride can be choppy on available 20-inch wheels. No hybrid option. Somewhat unrefined old-school engine. 2023 Infiniti QX60 Handling and Driving Impressions The Infiniti QX60's 3.5-liter V6 engine may be a bit agricultural in nature, but with 295 horsepower and 277 pound-foot of torque on hand, its performance is adequate for its size and market segment. It needs to be revved hard to do its best work, which detracts from the QX60's overall refinement. Forced induction would certainly not go amiss, but the acceleration on offer is class competitive. Expect a 0 to 60 miles per hour sprint in about 7.6 seconds, which is good, but also note that the engine's peaky nature means that overtaking will be raucous due to its need for high revs in the absence of turbo torque. Driving the Infiniti QX60 is best described as a distant experience, in the sense that the QX60 will change direction as required and with reasonable sure-footedness, but without any sense of eagerness or communication from the chassis. Due to its tall stature, the QX60 also exhibits noticeable body roll in corners, and the steering is accurate but doesn't relay much information from the asphalt to the driver. There are, however, many luxury SUV buyers who don't care about dynamic prowess at all and prefer a well-appointed, quiet, and comfortable cabin above all else, and these buyers will feel right at home in the Infiniti QX60. While there isn't much joy to be had from the driving experience, 
the high-quality cabin will more than compensate for any dynamic shortcomings, and for many owners, the QX60 will have exactly what they need on the daily commute. It's not intended to be sporty, so it simply isn't. Verdict, is the 2023 Infiniti QX60 a good SUV? Going by the requirements of its segment, the Infiniti QX60 is a very agreeable SUV and great value for money. There's plenty of cabin space, an attractive interior design rendered in high-quality materials, a smooth ride, and plenty of comfort and convenience features to keep all of its occupants content. Does it matter that the QX60 is wholly unremarkable in terms of its performance and driving dynamics? To the vast majority of potential buyers, not at all. However, buyers with a penchant for speed and dynamic polish may want to consider something like a similarly priced Volvo XC90 or Audi Q7 instead, because they both do better than the Infiniti in these areas. 2023 QX60 Exterior Having been substantially refreshed for the 2022 model year, the QX60 boasts handsome styling and has all-LED exterior lights from the base model, including digital piano key signature DRLs, pew trims are the entry-spec variants, equipped with 18-inch alloy wheels, power exterior mirrors with integrated turn signals and a power folding mechanism, and a power panoramic moonroof. Lux models have 20-inch alloy wheels and auto-dimming outside mirrors, while the top two trims get model-specific 20-inch wheel designs, body-side moldings with added chrome accents, front and rear chrome underguards, and a motion-activated lift gate. The autograph we had on test is the only model to come with a black roof and an adaptive front lighting system with an auto-leveling function as standard. Dimensions as the second biggest SUV in the Infiniti stable, the QX60's dimensions reflect its mid-size classification. Length is 198.2 inches, with a wheelbase of 114.2 inches and a width of 86 inches, including mirrors. It stands 69.7 inches tall. Ground clearance is 6.7 inches across the range, while approach, breakover, and departure angles are 15, 15.5, and 22.5 degrees, respectively. Curb weights vary depending on drivetrain and trim, with the FWD Pure models being the lightest at 4,393 pounds. The heftiest model is the AWD Autograph, weighing in at 4,657 pounds. 2023 QX60 Interior Much attention was given to an overhaul of the seven-seater QX60's interior, and the cabin is plusher, more modern, and more elegant than that of the previous generation car. Seven seats are standard across three rows, and the heated eight-way power adjustable, zero gravity, seats up front are fitted from even the base model. Leather upholstery is the standard fare in the first two rows, with semi-aniline quilted seats in the top and trim's first two rows. Tri-Zone Climate Control helps to keep things at an ideal temperature, while a 12.3-inch interactive display mounted high in the dash takes care of infotainment duties. There's ample space for even taller passengers, whether they are seated in the first or second row, and although third-row occupants will be a little snug, this is expected for three-row SUVs in the segment. The Autograph trim reduces seating capacity to six and fits captain's chairs in the second row. Seating and interior space The Infiniti QX60 is a three-row vehicle with seating for seven standard or six people on the top autograph trim. Most buyers will opt for the seven-seat version, which boasts a standard three-seat bench in the second row. The autograph gets second-row captain's chairs with an open storage console between them. The console is removable for more space and easier access to the third row. We found space in the second row to be adequate with the sliding, reclining captain's chairs. However, the Acura MDX offers more space plus a removable middle seat that doubles as an armrest. Thanks for watching. Drop a like. Leave a comment. And don't forget to subscribe to watch more videos like this.